yeah. Hello, my name's Jane and I'm from Crackerjack Blanks. Uh, Karen, my business partner, <laughs> or partner in crime, um, she's here as well actually. She's the camera woman. Let me just, um, come on Karen, you've got to say hello to everyone. Oh, here she is. Hello everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a wave. <laughs> <laughs> Karen's going to be filming, and uh, this is our very first uh, YouTube video, and we just want to um, go through uh, applying a base paint to a blank that you're going to decoupage, because we often see people saying, oh, my napkin's not looking, you know, um, isn't looking very bright or hasn't, doesn't seem to look very um, dynamic. Um, so um, here we go. So first of all, um, we've got our wooden shape. Oh. <laughs> Karen, you can speak. <laughs> You'll have to tell me if I'm not in focus. That's all right. I'm just waving the camera around a lot. <laughs> yeah. um, this is our wooden heart, um, our long uh, wooden heart that we're going to be decoupaging. And um, also have a just a normal household sponge that you use to do the washing up and we have some white household paint i'm just using a matte version uh, which is probably the best to use so all we have to do <laughs> uh, i just have to say here on our little practice run just now uh, we spilled paint on i spilled paint on the table I managed to get it on my sleeve but I think it blends in quite nicely with the pattern on my blouse so I'm not going to worry about that but please do take care if you are wearing something that you don't want um, to get paint on please do protect yourself with an apron or just some old clothes so I'm going to just get the sponge I'm going to dip it into the paint Not too much, about like that. Holding the heart, I'm just going to just dab it on, dab it all over. You can see that quite, you know, that little bit will go quite away. It looks a lot smoother than if you've done it with a, a paintbrush, doesn't it? Um, yes, you, some people do like to use a paintbrush. Um, but you will find that, you know, you'll get the stroke marks from the paintbrush where this is just going to be an even apply like that. And then... Oh gosh, and the sides as and well. And the sides. Yeah, that's something I would have completely forgot. Just to let everyone know, I'm a complete novice at uh, <laughs> actually doing this. So, uh, um, But you won't be for long, will you, Karen? No. Nope. Because you're going to be creating That's right. all sorts of lovely, beautiful things. So for all those new beginners out there, I'm just in the same boat as you are at the moment. So eager to learn a different craft and want to do something that uh, looks really nice. And there we are. Gosh, it's quite amazing, actually how different now, that, that heart looks like with just that, that paint on it, yes, doesn't it? yeah. I should have put my glasses on. <laughs> so, uh, rule number one, if you wear glasses, make sure you have them handy. <laughs> <laughs> so, you will find that this paint will dry quite quickly. So, um, I'm just going to pop it down now on the mat and let it dry and that is basically how you apply the base coat to the wooden shape that you want to decoupage and when that's dry jane do we do exactly the same to the other side if you're going to have this as a hanging heart so you would have a little hole in it um so that you can hang it up with a piece of ribbon afterwards then yes but if you're going to fix it to something solid um then oh, there's there's no point in doing the other side really i'll just do that one side okay brilliant so all we've got to do now is let that dry yeah okay. and uh we'll um we'll let that dry and then we'll come back to it and i will give it a second coat 
Oh, of the white paint. Of the white paint, okay. yes. Right, okay. So apologies everyone that we're actually filming this um, in, in the garage. Um, so um, apologies for all the surrounding things you can see. Mm. Um, but we just thought uh, it would be quite nice to um, try this out sort of as a, a trial video um, and just let you all know out there that uh, I'm a novice as well, so I'm definitely not going to be perfect at this point. Um, so we can all learn together. Um, we've got Jane as our expert. Oh. <laughs> Thank you all. <laughs>